Because the ones that honor the Father are truly blessed of the Father. And we have to really look at things like that. When you really honor the Most High, you get truly blessed by Him. When you honor Him. Because He looks at you with different eyes. He made everybody. He's made all of the nations. He's made all of creation. And gave them gifts. And makes the rain come down upon everybody. The just and the unjust. He gives all this knowledge. To help them farm. To help them take care of their families. Educates man. Yet they forget him. So you're truly blessed. If you know Yah. And keep his commandments. And transform yourself. Into being like his son Yeshua. Where you resemble him. In your appearance. Spiritually. You're truly blessed of Yah. When you act like him. Because that means you've gave yourself time to him where you could build a relationship with him. See, everything is Yah for you. Everything is Yah for you. It's not about the car you have. It's not about the clothes you wear. It's not about how much money you got in the bank. How much you're being respected by people. It's not about you. It's all about him. See, you're truly blessed of Yah when you understand Yah. When you understand about his divine nature. Hallelujah. You understand, Yah, when you can look at your neighbor and see yourself and see Yeshua at the same time. You're truly blessed to understand this understanding, this knowledge, because that means the Holy Spirit has come down and touched you. It's touched you where you can understand how to be heavenly, how to be like the righteous ones in heaven, because that's how they deal. We know that if anybody deals unjust in heaven, what happens? They get kicked out. They get excommunicated from the holy assemblies of Yah. Hashatan is the perfect example in all his angels that fell with him. So knowing the perfect understanding of Yah is knowing Yah, his character, how he is and how he deals with us, how he deals with mankind. So to truly know Yah is to understand his way. And to understand his way is for you to apply it in your life where people can see Yah in you. Not just what comes out your mouth, but in your actions, your physical actions, in the way you deal with people, the way you deal with your family, the way you sacrifice your life for Him. The way you've cut off your sins and you're not walking around speaking Yah being a hypocrite, but literally you've cut off your sins for Him. For Him you've done this. So you could be a vessel of righteousness where He can place His Holy Spirit upon you.